Okay, game two here. Um, I didn't play this real well, I'll be honest. Uh, it's probably not the prettiest game of Magic to watch. Uh, I was pretty happy with my opener though, but uh, yeah, he's, uh, he drew a few hate cards and I played a little too conservatively, I think. So uh, you'll see what I mean as I go on. So he gets a nice clock and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm pretty happy to have this Spiroclasm. And he's also got the Curse Cage, which makes me need to pay a bit more for it, but I've got a couple of mana rocks, so that's not too bad. As long as he doesn't play the board here, I'm, I'm in good shape. Uh, obviously, what happens, what, <laughs> my opponent has two blue up, what does that mean? So he's definitely got a negate, so he's got a clock and a gate, and that's, so that's great, but, um, so I'm happy to just develop my board here a little, and um, try to get him to commit some more. Missing a land drop is also good for me, so I can figure a fire off the pyroclasm try to get him to uh, to use the negate more than anything choose between his creatures and his counter spell and uh, yeah I just try to dig through my deck I think I probably should have gotten a uh, inventor sphere there so I could search up a second craft clan ironworks but I was backing myself to draw one and 17 land deck and I, I drew a few of those along the way so I ran out um, Ran out some scrap trawlers thinking that he's most likely got a negate and he has missed some land and um, I needed to uh, basically try to bait out that counter or get him to commit to the board for the race. Um, my opponent played this pretty well. Um, he also drew a series of lands off the top which allowed him to both establish his board and get more. Uh, you know, keep, keep that on the counter. So, it was a bit of a lost cause this game actually. Started to sacrifice some, uh, some artifacts to Cantrip to try to bait out the uh, him popping the, the relic. Um, doesn't deal with the obvious negate in his hand, but hit um, yeah one problem at a time, you know. Speed this up a little bit because kind of nothing happened for a few turns. And uh, yeah, there's a few trades going on. And uh, yeah, got me down to two with his mutavolts, etc. And I went, well, he either has it or he doesn't, and uh, I lost. So yeah, uh, if I'd drawn a second KCI, because uh, I had so much mana, like two mana rocks and all this land, um, and he so many at so many points along the the way, he only had the mana up for one negate. So I just didn't draw it. Uh, so uh, sort of, you know. Turn, was this turn nine? So on turn four, or whenever it was, three when I cast the um, the card that digs five, Ancient Stirrings. Um, if I'd gotten the Inventor Sphere, it would have had the ability to, in his end step or whatever, search up a um, a second copy of KCI, and I probably would have been able to win. But um, I guess that's why you test online because you want to learn these things so um yeah we went to a game three so we'll have a look at that <laughs> 